Good morning. All right, so this weekend was Ashley and I's birthday weekend. Mine was on the 16th, hers was on the 17th. And I turned 27. She turned 29. She's having a heart attack, but really she's not that old. She looks like she's still 19. Um, my birthday was interesting. Anyways, that's all I gotta say about that. Um, so she take me in those question thingies that she wants me to answer. <laughs> Too much info. So I'm at work, as I always am whenever I do a video. <laughs> Don't know why, but here we go. Okay, what am I wearing? I'm just wearing like a striped dress thingy. But I'm wearing it with leggings and then a black sweater over it. Okay. And then, have I ever been in love? Huh. Yeah, <laughs> I've been in love. I love my boyfriend. All right, have I ever had a terrible breakup? <clears throat> yeah. I have, um, I wouldn't say my last boyfriend, but the boyfriend before that, he left me for someone else, and how I found out was he called me from her house and told me he was leaving me for this other chick that he's been cheating on me with. It was great. Good times. Way to go. Anyways. How tall am I? I'm five foot eight, five foot nine, somewhere in between there. How much do I weigh? I weigh 135. Not too happy with that right now. Do I have any tattoos? No, I don't have any tattoos. Any piercings? I used to have my belly button pierced and I do have my ears pierced. Don't have any jewelry in them right now. My favorite show? Probably. Modern Family always is a good laugh. Um, keeping up with the Kardashians, yeah, I love that show. Um, oh, and Big Rich Texas, I miss that show. I love that show. Don't know why so much drama. My life's boring, so why not watch other people's drama, right? Favorite band, um, <laughs> One Direction, because that's like only the only boy bands nowadays, right? Unless you count like Simple Plan, but they're definitely not my favorite band. <laughs> Anyways, um, something I miss. Vancouver. Um, the city. Definitely having a really hard time adjusting. I actually just moved about a month ago to a really, really small town called Trail, BC. And um, they don't have the mall. They don't have a Starbucks. They don't have anything there. So I shop online and everything. I miss Vancouver so much. Like, I'm such a city girl. It's ridiculous. I just... Miss, miss the city. Vancouver's the most beautiful city in the world, I think. It has the city, it has the ocean, it has the mountains, it has the suburbs, it has the farms, it has everything somebody could ever want. Art appliance one, please. Art appliance one. Not me. Okay, good. Anyways, um, my favorite song, my favorite song right now would have to be... <clears throat> Snow White by Muttonhead, EDM, love, EDM, love house music, love all that kind of stuff, love hip hop, rap, R&B, pop music, classical, a lot of people don't know that I like classical, but I love classical music, I listen to it, um, I listen to it when I need to ease my mind and relax a little bit, um, anyways, how old am I? 27. <laughs> All right. What qualities do I look for in a partner? Somebody who can take care of me. Not take care of me, but like handle me. 
you can handle my personality. I'm pretty easygoing and everything, but when I'm mad, when I'm in a bitchy mood, it takes a certain type of person to be able to handle my bitchy moods, I think. <clears throat> and even, I even say that with my friends. My friends, they, um, they do a good job. They know when not to talk to me. They know what to do to make me feel better. They know everything. Um, and quality is also is someone who can actually make me laugh and I can have a conversation with someone who has goals and someone who wants more out of life because I want a lot out of life. I want everything. Um, favorite quote. <laughs> favorite quote. I can't even think. Oh, um, I'd probably have to say, for girls, don't be keeping, be kept, because it's very empowering, I think, because I don't think a girl needs a guy to give her everything or whatnot like all that I think if she's well kept already she can conquer the world um favorite actor favorite actor <laughs> are we going on looks or actually good actors okay I'll name two okay Zach Efron because he's sexy <laughs> and Liam Neeson love that guy good actor I think um favorite color I have multiple I'd have to say, I would always say pink first when I was younger, but no. We, um, I don't even know, favorite color, maybe like pink, purple, blue, green, mint, Ashley, mm-hmm, I love that color too. That's good on me. Um, how long does it take me to shower? Like Ashley said, it all depends on am I washing my hair, am I shaving, am I doing all that kind of jazz. Um, probably, she says 15 minutes to half an hour, what the fuck? No, 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 no. I can take like a two minute shower, wash my face, wash my whole body and I'm good to go. Or I can shave and take my time, and that's probably just like 15-20 minutes. How long does it take me to get ready? I'd go from anywhere from 10 minutes to 2 hours, depending on what I'm doing. Um, have I ever been in a physical fight? No. I think fighting's for kids. But yes, Ashley and I did punch each other out just to get out of school. But true. Uh, turn offs. My biggest turn off. Someone who's not ambitious. Um, yeah, I like people. I like guys. I like anybody who likes to do things, wants things out of life. I think that's such a big turn off when somebody's like, oh, I'm happy and content. Like, Oh, but you're not doing anything. It's, that's good that you're happy, but don't you want things? I don't know. I guess to each their own. Um, the reason we we joined you. The reason we joined the video. I don't know what that is. Anyways, uh, next one. What are my fears? Spiders. Uh, haunted houses. Um, someone making me eat something really, really disgusting, and, like, scary movie type situations, like if, like, my boyfriend and I, we were driving down in the States, and we just crossed the border from trail, um, going to Spokane, and in between there, there's, like, really super small towns and there's like abandoned houses and stuff like that 
and it's like all hicks that live there and it's scary what if it's like long term or like these hills have eyes or something like that scares me we could just like run out of gas or you know like get in a car crash or something and no one would ever know that scares me anyway the last thing that made me cry um Oh, talking to Ashley on the phone about how much I miss Vancouver and stuff like that. It's hard. <laughs> um, last thing you said, you left somebody this morning when my boyfriend dropped me off to work. Uh, the meaning behind your YouTube name. The meaning behind your YouTube name, like Ashley already said. Ashley and I used to work at McDonald's and we would always listen to music after the Bean Club was playing. And we would always go out for remix. <laughs> and that's also because we'd play CDs and they'd skip, and every time that they'd skip, we'd be like, remix. Awesome. Um the book I'm currently reading is a huge science book. I don't know why I love science and I love knowing everything now. When I was younger, you wouldn't find me reading a book ever, but this science book is it's awesome. I love finding out things, knowing things, stuff like that. Um, last show I watched was The Hills on DVD. Are we talking about TV? The TV, last TV show I watched. Mm. Last TV show I watched. The Mindy Project. That's a good one. Love that show. It's funny. Um, the last person I talked to was Steve. Actually, no, my boss. Yeah, my boss. Just like right before I made this. Um, what's the relationship I had with the last person I text? Which was Amy. Amy and I, we met a couple years ago when I was dating my ex. And she's really nice and funny. And she's, um, we're really good friends. We're starting to be really good friends. We started getting more close, I'd say, in the last few months than anything. Like this summer, my ex and I and her and his best friend would always hang out and stuff and like she's fun i like her a lot and talk to her she's funny talk about everything she's good good peoples uh, my favorite food god i can't pick one okay sushi sushi and ribs and tacos Pizza, pizza, oh yeah, pasta, I love every food, I can eat a lot, and I will eat a lot if I can, oh, wings and nachos, fuck, it's so good, I'm such a foodie, I love all kinds of food, um, place I love, I want to visit, uh, Barcelona, Ibiza, Paris, New York, I just want to travel, I just, that's what I want to do, I just want to make money, travel, Barcelona, I'd have to say. Last place I went to was Mexico, I believe. Yeah, and that was probably at the beginning of this year, actually, in April. Do I have a crush? Well, my boyfriend. If that's not my crush, it's like Efron. <laughs> Last time I kissed someone was this morning when my boyfriend dropped me off. Last time I was insulted, probably by my boyfriend. <laughs> When, um, oh, he said that it's important for me that when I go out, I get free drinks, and we had a, we we're having a conversation, and he totally missed the point. And then I was, I felt really insulted because I'm like, really, I'm not that type of girl that's just like, oh my god, let's go out and get guys buy us drinks. Like, who cares? No, 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 no. That's not what I meant at all. It was really insulting. Um, flavor, favorite flavor of sweet 
probably strawberry, cherry, blue raspberry. I can never pick one. Really indecisive. Decisive. Um, what instrument do I play? Hmm. The recorder. <laughs> the last time I played a sport. What sport was that? It'd probably have to be tennis. That was probably in the summer. Yeah, it's been a while. Last time I hung out with somebody. I hang out with my boyfriend every day. I had to say over a month ago I hung out with my friends. That was with Nav, sorry, back home. And choosing somebody to do these questions, I choose, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. I choose you, whoever you are. You can do this video. And I just want to say I love Ashley with all my heart. Love that lady. I hope she had a wonderful birthday. And uh, yeah, we've been through hell and back and can't wait to see what the future holds. I'll always be there. Love ya. Mwah.